December 4th. Today's the day. Today is my husband's work party day that we're hosting. So it's gonna get crazy. I just got a shower. Um, uh, lots, still getting ready, of course. It's just, you try to get things done ahead of time and then everything is left to the last minute, it seems like, or way more than I anticipated. So I, but what usually gets left out is that I forget to make time to get myself ready. So I went ahead and like, Stop doing things downstairs and come upstairs and at least grabbed a shower. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna get everything ready. Like I wanted to repaint my nails, but they look okay. But I had like a whole like Christmasy color theme I was gonna do. We'll see if I get that done. Um, I've shown you Advent and stuff. I'm all caught up on my stripey socks for Wands and Nosh. I'm not caught up on anything else. I'm not gonna get a lot of knitting done today. I did a little bit this morning when I woke up, but um, like I normally do. But then of course we have this party tonight that we're hosting and then 7.45 tomorrow morning, Brooke has a lacrosse game <laughs> that we found out last week. I'm like, really? And then none of her other games for the rest of the season, winter season, are that early. They're like in the afternoon, of course. So I'll be up bright and early with some knitting, and I plan on actually getting all caught up because tomorrow will be like a relaxing day, and I will be getting caught up on my advent knitting. And so I'll keep you some more, more knitting content tomorrow. Yesterday it went fabulous. So many people came. It was, 
I guess it was like the first time a lot of them had even like met each other in person. So that was really exciting. We had people come from New York and Pennsylvania and Maryland and we're here in Virginia. So it was really great, uh, great turnout. It was great to see everybody and um, meet new people. Um, so I obviously didn't put up Vlogmas yesterday because we were up super late and then crash and then Brooke had a game at 7.45 this morning. So we literally got like four hours sleep maybe. Um, and then came home after her game, which I'll include some clips of her game. She did great. I don't even know how because she was up kind of late too. She did great. Damon's flight got changed to later in the afternoon. So he got to actually go with me, which was great. We came home, took a nap. <laughs> I don't even know what day it is, I feel like. Uh, and he just left for the airport to go on his next work trip. So um, I'm looking at my kitchen and how much I need to <laughs> clean it from the party. And I respectfully decline <laughs> to clean up from the party because I promised myself if I got through all the prep for the party and the party is a lot of fun. But once I got through that, I need to be tired and that I'm going to focus on relaxing today for the rest of the day and my knitting. I'm gonna, I got clue two for Merrily. I'm casting on Merrily. I won't get to clue two, but I cast on Merrily, going to. I'm going to actually work on my blanket, my uh, Arabian Tales blanket, like put on the first, um, I've been calling them mermaid tails, you guys. They look like mermaid tails. Not the whole time. <laughs> Holly from Whiskers and Stitches was like, what are you talking about? Like the tail. Now, I So I meant the fins apparently and I just didn't specify. I When I'm thinking of mermaid tails, I'm meaning like the fin part of a mermaid tail, not the actual tail, clearly, <laughs> duh. <sighs> you guys are probably like, what is she talking about mermaid tails? And then, so she says she's been seeing fox faces. Do you guys see a fox face in this? I'm gonna put it right here. Do you guys see a fox face? Cause now I can't unsee it. Um, so I'm going to put like the first, hopefully one and two fins on there from the mermaid tail. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm calling it anymore. Um, and then I want to work on basically all the things. I want to work on all the things. Um, yeah. So I'll go ahead and show you all my knitting here in a little bit. Um, uh, once I get started and it's gonna be so much fun. I'm so looking forward to just relaxing with my knitting and getting caught up on advent and working on knitting and just relaxing and not having anything to do. So it's going to be a good day. So excited um, and then what you do is you choose if it was knitting or crochet I chose knitting for Rebecca's pattern and it's gonna be it's a DK weight shawl and then they send you each Sunday you open up the next skein of yarn and also you get a clue um, so I already got clue two I have not cast on so I do plan on casting on with um, yarn one and clue one today but let me go ahead and open clue two well open the yarn for clue two the theme I chose was evergreen speckles um, so let's see how this works out. Ooh, look at that. Oh my 
my goodness. So pretty. It's like, you can't really tell in person, but it's definitely tinted green. It looks a little tinted on camera, but in, in person, it's definitely like almost a minty green base, but very light. So pretty. Maybe it'll just say color B. Yep. This is DK weight is on her Calvert DK. And the clue one already indicated this is going to be a winged triangle shawl, which I do not believe I've ever done. So I'm really excited about this. So I'm going to cast it on. So these are 50 grand skeins. The first three are 50 gram skeins. And the fourth week Sunday for the advent is a full 100 gram skein. So I'm just do it in my scrappy angel bag, baby Yoda. I have the, like I haven't even cast it on yet. So this was the first one. And so here's the next color. So you see how it's getting into that evergreen. It's a nice fadey action going on here. So I'm going to cast on this one. I will not get all the way through this today, but then this will be the next one. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. So pretty. I've also made an administrative decision. So this was my original choice for Desert Vista Dye Works, my December colorway socks. Um, I'm doing the seventh annual Desert Vista Dye Works sock along, sock knitting club. I forget what it's called, honestly. Um, where you knit a pair of socks each, each month and you accumulate discounts. And at the very end of the year, if you were able to go ahead and knit one, um, one sock each month all year, you get a free specialty colorway skein that she dyes up for everybody. Um, so this is my very last month. I've totally caught up this whole year. Obviously, I can't open zippers one-handed. Um, I have caught up all year. <laughs> there. Um, so this is my last one. But of course, it's like my busiest knitting month ever. So I really wanted these. I loved these when I first got them. They're just stripey socks or holiday stripes. Um, one sock would have been thin stripes and one strop one sock would have been thin stripes, which I don't know if that's that one. And the other one would have been thick stripes, but the same color sequence. They're going to be so cool. But I'm realizing that I don't have a lot of time for knitting, even though it's only the fifth. I just know I have so much knitting going on that I should just make DK socks because I've been making the last couple DK socks and actually I love DK socks. Um, and I could do that with these, but I, that's just extra. I don't want to break these two halves into like halves of those because what I want to do is I want to match up the stripes and hold them together um these are already split so what I normally do is I take a whole skein I split it into two right at the same color point and then I just hold them together and make one sock at a time um this would be cool for if I want to make two socks at a time or whatever so I'm going to save these and I'm going to go ahead and put those away and I'm going to I have one another Christmas color that I loved and I almost chose this one instead um, this is even a sparkly base and I love this because it's Christmas colors, but also has purple in it, which is my favorite color. So like, I think that's totally cool to have Christmassy with purple. And this one is called Zombody's Kissing Santa Claus. And I love the Zombody line because it always means the speckles, or speckly stripes. I love that. So I'm going to go ahead and, um, and I haven't even, because normally we have to tell them what color we're doing at the beginning of the month. Um, and post it in Ravelry and I just haven't done mine yet. So I'm going to go ahead, cake this baby up, enter it on Ravelry, um, and get going on this. That way I will have, I, I'll have less stress. I'm making sure I get these done in time, um, before the end of December. So I'm really excited. It's going to be awesome. And they're sparkly. I don't think I have any sparkly Christmassy socks yet. So this will be fun. So I'm gonna go ahead and swap these out, get this all caked up, get started. I'm going to cast on the Merrily shawl. And I'm going to work on my crochet, just feel cozy wrap. And I'm going to start my Arabian Tales blanket. I'm going to do so much knitting today. It's going to be crazy, y'all. But so much fun.